All right, we took down the Ark. Now we're gonna get, apparently go into the portal that leads us to the Kingdom of Sorrow. Which, it still makes me wonder a bit. I guess, like, no, the Ark was made to, um, it was saying just to connect the worlds, but the portal to the worlds is still there. And I think connected, connected to where, like, the Kingdom of Sorrow could actually screw everything over. But it's there, you can still go there. Okay, let's go. Yeah, apparently I kicked your ass pretty hard, huh, Leo? With the amount of platform I'm about to do here, you it won't even matter. So yeah, this is gonna be a fuck you. This one's gonna be a fairly long one as well, if I remember correctly. So, yeah, we're at the Kingdom of Sorrow. This is actually the last little level we're going to go through before the final boss. So, why did I do that? Yeah, whatever. Come on. Alright, let's try not... There we go. I got it right this time. You can't say anything to me about me screwing up. I didn't screw up. You screwed up. Uh, I'll shut up now. Alright, so yeah. It's gonna get really pretty cool. We're gonna. Fuck! Oh, this thing moves! But yeah, but once we get to like the final boss day, of course, we're gonna probably get some answers to many things. So. We're cool. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna make sure I don't suck too hard. Let's go. Cause like I said this is gonna. This level is a bit longer, if I recall, compared to the other levels. Like I think this might be arc length long. Or, oh, fuck. Oh. I missed. I missed my chance. Oh! Fuck. Okay, okay. I think I remembered why I took him too long. Good guy. There we go. Nothing to do with this. No, it's not. It's not too much for a dream, Traveler. Oh, I remember you. Stop staring at me. Oh, yeah. Chase! Nope. I'd love to see you try. I'd love to see you try again on that spring. Once again, really love the soundtrack on this level. 
Ooh, yeah. What? No! How did I keep on missing these? I don't know why. I don't know how. I keep on missing these pork and like, ugh. Come on. We're lay on like the last level four of the boss, the final boss. Let's get this going without like screwing up too much. Good thing I have a lot of lives, yeah. Because I, like, it feels like clutch, like door Phantom Mill. What play like what for? Like yeah, I don't think this is. Ugh. I mean, I have at least some room for mistakes. So if I die, I don't have to worry too much unless I start dying way too much. Ooh, I thought I missed it again. Oh my god, that's a treadmill. Nuh uh. Nope. Just fall down the hole. Oh my god, no! I did it again. <laughs> Good thing I actually have some place to go back to, though. Let's just, um. Okay, whatever. We're, we're alive. We're still alive. Oh, you're about to see some bullshit right here. I still ended up getting hit. That might be because I floated. Well, I'm not gonna fuck with them. Because, yeah. Uh... Oh. Oh god. Hey. 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 Uh... Hey! Hey! Come on! Dance with me! Dance with me! Aha! I told Dad to you are brother! Whoops! I think he's just gonna... Oh yeah, that's right, they had two shells on me. I think this is like the only time we've really seen them though, because um... Hey, I don't remember them in any of those. Whatever, what's... I gotta win track that one. But I don't care. I just want the screw though. <laughs> Whatever, we gone. Whoo! You are huge. There's a one up there. I'm gonna get that. One thing I also know about this game, yeah, they made it a, a lot more easier to get the Phantom Mill. Because, it's been, like, partially because it's just. They put the one ups in. They're very lenient with the one ups. So. Like, oh, I need, oh no, I'm getting long lives, what should I do? Oh, there's one up right there. And that's why I have so many lives right now. Say it goes with what? Oh, I, I nudged it. Ah, I don't know if I even miss like the little toy animal thing. Anyway. Like, sure, you have less health, but you have a lot more lives. I think the leniency on the lives is their, um, fuck, is their, is to compensate for the lack of health you have in this game, because you have six hit, you have six pieces of health in the first, in the first Quinoa, in this one, it's only three, they took out half of you, I don't know what made Quinoa so much more squishier in this game, he's apparently a lot more fragile than he was in in the first game, and he was a lot, and I believe he was a lot more younger than, like, at, he's still like kid, but like, maybe like close to teen years at this point. I'm just making bets here because they never do like, make anything clear on as to how old Kanoa is. I don't know why I'm putting so much thought into something like this. But it's always something that came, that I, that always came to mind with the other time I thought about Kanoa. Now, ooh, oh, ooh. okay. We're making good progress. Ooh, you almost had me. Almost had me. <sighs> All right. Checkpoint. Ah, let's see where this is going. I gotta, gotta aim. Just get lucky. Nope. <laughs> uh, this might take a while. Uh, just give me. 
Come on. Mm -hmm. Ah! Gotcha! Patience is a virtue, people. Remember that. Oh yeah, oh, here's another one. Okay, so yeah. Ignore that. Anyway. I just need to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. Yeah. Yeah. Right now, no. Hoo hoo! Ah ha! Mm -hmm. Once again, this is one thing I really love about the Kanoa series. Its trademark is the fact that Kanoa's double jump is based around using his enemies for it. And with this, I like how Nanko was able to make some creative, like, little puzzles with this. Which not only tests your brain power, it tests your platforming skills as well. And it's always nice for that, because, um, games like, right, you remember Super Meat Boy? I think y'all remember Super Meat Boy, especially the ones that played it. That one really tests your platforming. In this game no different. It's a lot more simpler, but it definitely tests makes you think of it when doing this. Oh yeah, this one I remember. Yo, 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 what's up? Can you make Oh I missed it again! I did it too early! Now, the safer thing to do would be to just... Okay, well... I just gotta be careful because, um... You know what? I'm gonna skip that. I'm not even gonna take the chance. I really... I'm not even gonna take the chance. I'm not even gonna take the chance on these gems. I know, a bit boring, but I'm gonna try playing it safe. I actually wanna try going through this without dying too much. Now, this one, I can't avoid. I, unless I want to die... Ooh! I thought I was too late. Mmm. Yeah! Okay, clean. That's not taking too long. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey. What are you doing throwing your boomerang? Ow. You still hit me. Ooh. Yeah, see, and once again, the super hearts, like, I think this game would have went just fine without them. Because there are a lot of moments where they put two single hearts on there, down there. And then there's ones where they just give you, like, two, um, like, that super heart that just fills up your health entirely. And it just seems like, eh, I feel like I don't need it too much in this game. Because, like I said, it's only three hearts. I can do just fine with just the single hearts. Ooh. So like when I get the super heart, most of the time when I get it, I either have not gotten hit or I just only got hit once and I can do this fight with a single heart. Ah. I use your own combat against you. How do you like me now? Now, I believe I talked about this before, that a game I really want to try playing is Kanoa Heroes. Now, if you don't know what that game is, or have never heard of it, it, uh, it's a Kanoa title that was only launched in Japan. It was on Game Boy Advance, it was one of the Game Boy Advance side games, but I feel like it was one of, it was one of the more unique, it was definitely the, one of the most unique Kanoa games, because unlike this one, unlike the other, like the main games, and the two other um, Kanoa Game Boy Advance games, which was um, Dream Champ Tournament, and uh, what was it? Fuck, it was... Fuck, what was it called? I'm actually playing it. Empire of Dreams. Empire of Dreams, I believe. I think it was Empire of Dreams. Either way, yeah, compared to all the other ga the main games, the, those side games, it was unique just because it was 
it was an action RPG kind of thing. With like skill stats and everything. You could even use um guns and another character. I keep on forgetting his name because seeing how I usually don't see him around, but you usually do see guns around, which who first appears in Dream Jam Tournament. Championship. What's the tournament? It was a champion. I think it was championship, not tournament. What? Pardon my um use of not being able to name shit correctly. Oh my god. But yeah, it's one game I really play. Now, you must wonder me, like, well, why Shores on Japan could just get an English patch? Well, the problem is, there is no English pr Oh my god, I missed. Oh wait, I could've... Stupid, stupid, stupid. Whatever, anyway. The thing is, there is not an English patch around. At least from what I've seen. I've checked numerous times. I have yet to see an English patch. And I really want there to be an English patch, because I want that to know what's going on. It's an RPG, so most of the time I do like seeing how a story plays out in those. And I also want to see just how the gameplay goes, because it definitely feels like um, a difference in just gameplay. And it also shows up whatever, shows off whatever I think, you know. If I recall in the uh, crossover game, was it? Was it Namco X Capcom? Yeah, I believe it was Namco X Capcom. Kanoa and Guns are play are playable schemes in that game. And I believe Kanoa uses some of his moves from Kanoa Heroes. And I don't know that's pretty cool. It's like one thing that's very noticeable with Kanoa Heroes, Kanoa, is the fact that he uses he has a wind sword on that one. He actually has a sword in that, which is pretty cool. I was going to see, like, how would you fight with the wind sword? I'll just say, like, yeah. Everyone thinks, like, a shuriken, a hammer, which is, like, one of those pointed, like, hammers, like, kind of like one of those pointed hammers. Like, you don't see something like that every day. Oh, oh that's water. Of course it's water. Ah, I... Pardon me for that one. Right, dude? Out. Oh fuck! Uh, anybody keeping a death counter? Because I'm not. I said there's no death counter. Fuck! Fuck! Oh god, no, no, no! That's not really all the lives I got. No, those are hard-earned lives. Well. Oh my god! We're not gonna go after that. But we already passed up one of them. There's no point in getting the other ones. I'm trying to hunt this quickly, let's just get through the game. We're hitting the 20 minute mark, getting close to the 20 minute mark. Oh, this, this section is fine. I like Kanoa a little slow. Which brings me to my next little subject. I know I'm talking about random stuff here, but hey, it's better than talking about nothing, right? I noticed that um, a lot of people like playing the Kanoa series with the Sonic series. Now, I know I'm not the only one that notices this, with, um, this, and I'm getting, I won't blame people for it, because Kanoa does, once you look at, look at him a bit, he does kind of look like he would be in, like, the Sonic series, and I won't blame anyone for that, too much, but it's, like, the relations to, like, characters, like, so far, most I've seen is with Tails, and that confuses me, because, there's not much relation to it. Okay, well, it looks like I'm done talking here. Because we're at the end. So I was talking about saying it was it was close to Arc of... It was close to um, Arc... Level one. But yeah. Here we are. Uh, it took a bit a lot longer to get out to this part now to the point where now we're near the end we're actually at the end game or well, that's because a lot of stuff's been coming up and all that but yeah in this next one this will be the final battle and i'm going to have a lot of fun with it i'm going to show tell you pretty much this is probably one of my favorite parts in the game which we're not going to see one of my, our favorite characters in the game which will probably make you wonder i don't know either way that's all for this one I'll see you in the finale. Laters.